guys hope you are doing amazingly well welcome to my channel if you are new here kindly subscribe like the video and you leave us a comment down below before we go on with this video i want to say a thousand apologies i've been missing in action for some time reason being i've been strong here they say strong i've not been feeling well but i'm back you know when you change weather change location sometimes it happens and that's the reason why you have not been seeing me but i am back and i want to show you this amazing video if you follow me i did a video of where i was planting in my farm yes i got a farm here in nigeria and i was planting maize and cassava and maize is already grown i've eaten even eaten some i've roasted i've boiled and i'm enjoying myself here so that's the reason i want to do this video so that at least you can do a follow-up of when i planted my maize and cassava how did it go on so as i've told you i've already eaten maize and i'm going to the farm so that you can understand and see what kind of farming am i doing here and i say last time eh this farm i was given this farm it's not that i've rented or anything that is the sweet things that i enjoy when i'm here in this country this country is amazing to me and this farm i was given i was told you can plant whatever you want you can do whatever you want to do in this farm and i decided let me plant maize and cassava because maize with three three months you are done and you're enjoying your maize and then cassava will continue to grow it go on very very well and i've been enjoying myself although that part i've been unwell but i'm fine and i'm okay now so let me show you how i'm doing on with the farm i'm missing corn and i want to at least boil some and you can boil it if you like you can cook maize and beans they cook it here and the way they cook it is so sweet their beans are so sweet and the corn so that's the reason why hey if you eat it you really enjoy can you hear the birds hey it's a beautiful morning here in africa i normally say africa is so beautiful africa is amazing another thing i want to talk about is uh, how how good people have been to me even that time i was strong people were very kind they helped me in the farm that's why you can see even some parts of the farm yeah i don't know where i'll enter the farm some parts of the farm people have already helped me remove so they were i really want to thank them yes we ate corn together we enjoyed you know you have to share with your neighbors whatever you have harvested so we shared the corn i gave a corn and there were too much even i sold them so at least i got something yeah so i got something back so let's go to the farm so that i can show you this is one of the farm i have more oh, this is one of the farm that i want to remove corn so that you can see how i'm faring here in nigeria you know i've blocked this place i'll enter like this this is one of the farm you can see cassava is growing that is how it is going on the mist is there you can see some places there is no mist because it has been cut as i've told you people ate corn uh, and uh, they have enjoyed themselves we shared with neighbors as i said too much some of it was too much i sold and i got some cash and cassava is still going on so i'll still wait by the grace of god to harvest cassava that is niger for you their soil is so good that is one thing that i noticed their soil is so good it's so amazing that whatever you plant you you harvest you harvest this is my bag this is what i want to put and you can see you cannot miss something to eat here so you enjoy your harvest so that is what i want to do today and i show you that uh, whether you are from this country this amazing country nigeria you can do farming farming is amazing that is if you love farming it's not everybody who loves farming by the way if you love farming is amazing you have your own food i now i don't have to buy corn i'll just get from my farm i also harvest cassava that is extra cash so if you come back you say ah, what can i do this is one of the things that you can do plus other things that i'm doing here that i'll show you yeah so this is my farm as you can see some corn is not there because it has been removed 
people have enjoyed themselves and of course i cannot miss some corn where i'll go and eat yeah this is what i want to do today so it's an early morning and i want to start my morning in the farm <laughs> in the farm yeah you can see so that is how my then my bag is here whatever i want to cut i i can harvest it and the, the good thing uh, with the corn here as you harvest corn there are so many things you can use with corn a part of uh, roasting and uh, and boiling and cooking meats and beans they also make pap something called pap it's like a uh, porridge something called pap they do it here and there are so many things that you can get from the from corn so that is what is amazing happening here so today i wanted to show you how my farm performed and i can say it performed well because these are the remaining of what we have eaten we have enjoyed so these are remain the remaining ones and even after harvesting you have still you have also gotten your money back so it's not that you can lose anything it's gain a hundred percent and normally say a farmer normally benefit a hundred percent so the corn is still there and you can join me and harvest corn or you can join me after we harvest corn yeah as we are gisting we roast it we roast corn as we are gisting so this is what i want to do this morning i'll start my morning in the farm this is how my farm is performing this is how my farm is performing and i'm loving it see the cassava see this cassava i love it you see how it's performing very well within some months here i'll be harvesting and i'll see something something from my farm you know when you do something that you are seeing good results you are happy and for me i'm happy this, anywhere right now in the world a farmer is smiling because no matter how things are expensive and they are expensive for sure all over the world things are very expensive i cannot only stay here in nigeria it's all over the world so as a farmer and a farmer now an international farmer, <laughs> i'm harvesting something and i'm getting something so that is what is happening and welcome to my channel if you have not subscribed to my channel kindly subscribe so that you can see more of what i'm doing here and what is happening here in nigeria and many other things can nigeria this is a beautiful beautiful country and has a lot to offer can you imagine if someone just tells you you are not even from here but someone say you can go to my farm and um, you can go to my farm and plant whatever you want I, you know i ask am i paying they say paying care you are not paying anything just plant take care of the farm and that is what i'm doing yeah so we are all enjoying people for here we are sharing together we are enjoying ourselves yeah staying together as good neighbors and you can see i'm happy the cassava i'm loving the cassava the way it's performing you see it's almost my size <laughs> So it's performing very really well it's performing very well i've missed being in the in the farm huh? but i thank god for people around they were they are so amazing and they really helped me when i was strong to take care of the farm yeah is to help me imagine even to help me remove corn and look for people who can buy Actually, ah nigerians may go may god bless this country that will be the best country in the world that to continue to perform very well because nigerians are very good people they help you they are there for you they don't want to let you fail they want to see you succeed and they are happy when they see good results because even buying ah, they, they will come for you they will come for for it and and buy for you so it's an amazing it's amazing it's amazing thing and i'm loving it do you love farming wherever you are watching me from are you a farmer <laughs> leave your comment do you love farming are you planning to start farming <laughs> leave a comment you can see 
Yeah? Now, all this corn, I'll share because I cannot finish all of it. For this one, for today, I want to boil. I'm missing boiled corn. And that is what I want to do today. I cannot finish the corn I'll carry from the farm. So I'll share so that we can all of us enjoy together. Yeah. So this is how people do. And farming is good and you get something out of what you have been doing. So these are the remaining ones. You can see there are so many, so many and people have uh, helped me remove. And also the birds. <laughs> you don't eat alone though. The birds will help you to eat. So you can see like this ones, the birds have been eating. They have been eating. And imagine also, uh, corn is also expensive now. It's not like before. Corn is expensive because one corn, they are selling it, one roasted corn, they are selling it at 200 naira. That is one roasted corn. So you see, these are tough. So as a farmer, you see something. You see something. I'm not uh, miss something. And the ones which will dry, some of them I will carry it so that, like this one, I will hang it so that I can... Uh, I can use it for chicken when they dry very well. You just take it, they'll grind it for you. After grind it for you, you have food also for, for kitchen. By the way, leave your comment. What other thing that you can use to make corn? Apart of the things that I've said, that you can roast it, you can boil it, you can cook meat and beans, you can make pap. What other thing does, do you use to make corn, wherever you are watching me from? Yeah, leave your comment. Yeah. Here they call it corn. Our side we just say maize. But here they they love calling it. And this is yam. This one which is growing here. That is yam. So it's a beautiful morning. And I've seen your love, I've seen your support. Thank you for supporting me. We have already reached five thousand subscribers. Congratulations to us. The family is growing. We are going far. And it is amazing. It is amazing. I thank you so much for subscribing to my channel, for your support. I see you all. I see your sweet comments. I see you all. And I thank God for you and for your love. For your love. It's recently also, you know, I've noticed weed grow very fast in Nigeria. Weed grow very fast. You have to rush because of the weed. So they recently removed weed from this side also, but some is still having weed, so they need to take care of it. I've looked for some person to help me so that we can do it together. Yeah. This is how my farm looks like. So if you followed me when I was planting the other farm, this is the result of one of the farm. There is another farm up there and I'm also going to show you another farm that I've started and that one I've already uh, been helped to plant maize and cassava. So you can you see that the maize have already started to grow. There's a lot of rain. It's rainy season and you can plant and also as I've told you maize grows very fast. Within three months you have already harvested. So it's, it's something good. So within a year you can plant three times. You see it's a beautiful thing. Maize. I want them to remain in the farm so that they can continue dry. And the ones which are not done very well, they can continue to, to mature. Some of it is not mature very well so that it can continue to mature. So this is the farm. It's a big farm. It's a big farm, as you can see. It's a big farm. So the cassava is still going on very well. I will still come back again and harvest because there's still more corn in the farm. There's still more corn. Yeah. That is Nigeria for you. That is Nigeria for you. For me. For me. Apart from that time when I was strong, but I've been strong. But I thank God I'm okay now. I'm very, very okay. You know, when you change weather, sometimes something happens. But you can see, 
is going on very well. I was telling you that corn has been removed a lot of a lot of corn, as you can see, and uh, the cassava is doing very well. Yeah, cassava is doing very well. This farm cassava is going on very well. Within no time, hey, another harvest for cassava cannot be hungry if you are trying and i'm trying <laughs> you cannot be hungry if you are trying in this country and i'm really trying i love food <laughs> i love eating and they say if you don't work you cannot eat though so i have to work so that i can eat yeah, yeah this is how it is going on we have removed weed for that side there's still more cassava here up here this is the first place that i i removed corn this is the first sorry this is the first part that i removed corn and you can see the weed have also grown you need to be removed sorry sorry it's because of this guy that is how the place looks like so the remaining corn i'll also remove together now everything is going on very very well I'm so grateful for the people of this area. They have been very, very helpful. They have been very kind. They have helped me a lot, a lot. And it's good to stay with your neighbors very well. And the funny thing, I was told whatever is in, in this farm, I can carry it. Now imagine, I have popo there. Show them the popo. I have popo on that side a lot. And down there. So all this purple now, I'm waiting for them to watch here. I also have plantain in the farm, so I can eat when they grow. And I've already removed one plantain which was ready. So I'm benefiting in everything. Yeah, if you are, I normally say, if you go to any country that loves you, appreciates you, treats you well, for me, it is home. So for me, I'm home because uh, I am at peace, I'm loved here, I'm appreciated, they appreciate my work, they love my work, they love me. And any place you go and you are loved and appreciated, you, you feel at home and you feel this is the place that I belong. And that is what has happened for me here in Nigeria. Sorry I keep doing this because of the flies. You are in the farm, you should understand that. So that is what I see here in Nigeria. I've received all that and even more. Now imagine, whatever I'm growing, I'm selling to them, they're appreciating, they're loving my work, and I'm, I'm thank God to be here. Nigeria is a beautiful country. The, the weather now, I've adapted and it's good. As you can see, it's early in the morning and the weather is lovely. The weather is lovely. So I've finished my morning where work, I relax, I relax. Let me take you to the other farm. I don't know where I'll pass, I'll pass here. Let me show you. There is another farm I'm doing. Today we are doing farming. I started with the farming. <laughs> I've come back to show you more about farming. Because you know what? No matter where you are, you've got to eat. Yo. You've got to eat. So this is my other farm. This one. Can you see? This one. I was also given this farm. I was told I can plant whatever I would like to plant. And I've already planted uh, maize, as you can see. Maize is growing here. And uh, that is what is happening. It is doing very, very well. And the, in the midst of maize, there is cassava and a little bit of tomato. So I've planted something that is going to do very well. This is tomato here. Here, this is tomato that is growing here. Yeah, so that is what is happening. So this one, that the corn is small. Is that. Come this side so that they can see the corn. So they will see the corn. You see how the corn is doing very well? Can you see the soil? How it's good? And all this corn that I've grown here and I've harvested that we are eating, is organic corn. I did not spray. I did not do anything. I just planted the corn. It has grown all by itself. No putting fertilizer, no putting 
anything. Even my own, I did not spray anything. The way people spray cassava, I did not spray anything. So it's just organic. And that is something that I've noticed here. Even my body, my body is appreciating organic food because there's a lot of organic food. Yeah, so this is what is happening. Yeah, thank you so much. I hope you have enjoyed this video. For me, I've loved so much to come back. I've missed you so much, guys. I'm glad that I'm okay and I'm back. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your support. I've seen you all. And uh, leave your few comments. I've missed you. And uh, for this video, I want to edit here. I've loved my morning. It was a beautiful morning, as you can see. It's a beautiful, beautiful morning here in this part of africa that is nigeria i would like to say bye for now because it's for now and see you on the next one